For the second time this week, we got a school campus that was sent into a panic after somebody set off fireworks. Today, it was Carter Junior High School in Arlington. They were put on lockdown this afternoon. This just days, though, after a similar incident we reported on over at Duncanville High School. Robbie Owens live for us today, right near Carter, with the community reaction to this. Robbie. Well, Doug, there's relief, of course, that everyone is safe, but there's also anger here with school shootings being such a real concern that anyone would find that fear funny. At Carter Junior High in Arlington, students reported hearing gunfire. It's a lockdown, lockdown. Everybody started running around to go hide, but we couldn't find a place to hide. So intentional panic. The predictable response. Did you think it was a real shooting? Yes, because everybody was calling their parents. My granddaughter called me and told me that uh, there were shots inside the school. How scared were you? Very scared. I was actually crying because, like, I didn't want like die in front of my like. I didn't want to just leave my my siblings, my dad, my mom, my family. Those frantic parents huddled in the cold, waiting for police to give the all clear. The massive response, simultaneously reassuring. And worrisome. All this that's going on right now, that doesn't look like firecrackers. So I'm just thinking the worst, you know, with everything that's been going on, shootings, and it's, I, I just, I, I don't even know how I made it. I was so nervous the whole way. SWAT searched every inch of the building before giving the all clear. We do know at this time that it was, in fact, fireworks that were lit and set off inside the school. There was no gunshot. There was no gun involved in this incident at all. Um, and now it's being turned into a police investigation. We're trying to get that student identified, and charges will be filed. It's just scary to go through that. You should never have to go through that. Now, it was just this week that Arlington police, along with the FBI, launched a new awareness campaign called Fake Threat, Real Regret, trying to get the word out that law enforcement will take these situations seriously. Nothing too funny about getting arrested. Live at Carter Junior High in Arlington, Robbie Owens, CBS 11 News.